Power BI, we all love Power BI, but there are a few interesting facts about Power BI you probably didn't know. In 2010, the first idea of what is known today as Power BI was conceived and it was called as Project Crescent and it was designed by Ron George. In 2011, it was codenamed as Denali and it was available for public download as a SQL Server package. Denali. Denali Crescent are, were then renamed in 2013 as Power BI for Office, it, which was an Excel plugin, Power Pivot uh, plugin onto Excel and play around the DAX queries and everything. And then in 2015, out came what we know today as Power BI available for general public. So guys, did you know about, know about all of these before? And then how is it used? This is the architecture of Power BI. You have data sources, multiple data sources, web connectors, SQL servers, SSAS, Oracle, NoSQLs, and big data connected to the Power BI desktop, which is your developer tool. Now from here, you can decide to go on the cloud or on-prem for sharing. Now for desktop, it's the developer tool, the IDE, the development environment, and then, so it's a Power BI service, which is the cloud-based platform. And then you have the delivery options on laptops, iPads, mobile devices. And then if you want to stay on-prem, you have Power BI report server, which will keep everything on-prem, but still do the same kind of delivery as the service. Obviously, there are some limitations, but details later, this is what is Power BI. I hope this was good.